people who are opposed to the Second Amendment aren't to be taken seriously in life simply because you can't trust them with simple logic. The right to defend yourself exists. It's inherent in nature. It isn't up to a group of rich people that I've never met to decide whether or not I get to defend my family. Want proof? Camouflage, fangs, venom, claws, stingers. Just wander into the jungle. See how defenseless all of our neighbors are. They didn't ask the Jungle Congress. And let's say they strip the Second Amendment. You think the hundred million gun owners are just gonna, what, give them up willfully? Oh, shoot. Of course not. Plus, how exactly do you think the government is actually gonna enact its gun laws on people? Wait for it. Men with guns. Men with guns. They're going to send men with guns to initiate violence against nonviolent people who haven't harmed anyone. People opposed to the Second Amendment are actually for gun violence and they can't even recognize it. But you know what really bothers me is when these celebrities come out firing shots against the Second Amendment. Jennifer Aniston, Jessica Alba, shit I'd unload on them. Oh, and Eddie Vedder. Eddie Vedder, the lead singer of Pearl Jam. No wonder they kept calling him daughter. Man, when Eddie Vedder set his sights on the Second Amendment, I had to laugh. You'd think if anyone would want people owning guns, it'd be him. I mean, think about it. The only reason his career with Pearl Jam took off was because of that whole incident with Nirvana and the shotgun when, well, whatever. Never mind. <laughs>